belong to SMS College of Technology. Our institution has bought up a boot camp named Design Thinking in order to provoke students' innovative minds. This camp increased us to indulge in projects based on real-time problems. The students were separated into different teams and we are one among them. Our team guide, Dr. J. Ajayan, has worked with us in bringing up this successful project. We have chosen the problem commonly faced by the truck owners. At present situation, to check the load capacity of the truck, it is mandatory to go to Weybridge. It is completely time consuming because the entire process includes first initially the weight of the truck is measured then the weight of the truck along with its load is measured. In order to find the load capacity, the difference between the former and later has to be found out. But this process is very tiresome and requires lots of man work. So to replace this situation, we have brought a solution into existence which is ultimately our project, self-weight monitoring system in trucks. And the components that we have used in our projects are a load cell. A load cell is used to transform physical force into digital signal. And next is load cell amplifier. The specification is HX711. It is used to convert digital signal into proper unit. Here it is grams. Arduino ANO. It is an embedded microcontroller which operates hardware on software input. LCD display. Here we have used LCD display to display our required output. Next is potentiometer. Here, the potentiometer is used in our project to control the brightness of LCD display. Next is reset switch. Reset switch is used to calibrate the load or pressure. The working of our project is as follows. When there is absence of weight on load cell, initially it shows its minimum weight that is 0 grams. On the basis of the pressure applied on the load cell, the weight varies accordingly. Here, the pressure applied by the finger represents the load on the truck which is displayed here.